YouTube. It's your boy the Retro Wiz Kid, the Shoeologist, and y'all rocking with your boy in the Sneaker Dungeon. First things first, happy Monday. Hope everybody had a good day at work today. All those that, you know, kids that me, that are in school, I hope y'all enjoy school today. Another, you know, we back, we back at it. Back at it with another week. So, before we start this video though, Go ahead and subscribe to the channel if you have not already joined the Dungeon Family. We're on the road to 250 subscribers, y'all. Ring that notification bell as well. That way y'all don't miss any of the content I put out on the channel. Give your boy a thumbs up if you guys like the video. And without further ado, like always, drop a comment below and let me know what y'all thought about the video and if y'all rocking with your boy. All right, so I did it again for y'all, man. Early. Got them early. Not too early, but early. So you've already seen these shoes floating around social media. You know, some people got them and did reviews on them already, but you didn't get one from your boy, the Retro Wiz Kid. So you already see what it is. It's that Jordan 1 box. So you already know what time it is. These shoes dropping this Saturday on the 24th of March. Got them a couple days early for you all. And the colorway is the Game Royal Black Summit White. So let's go ahead and crack these bad boys open, y'all, and get to it. So, you know, blessings, blessings, blessings. I'm going to pull both of them out for y'all. So, bam, there they are, man. Them Game Royals, y'all. Game Royals. Hyper Royals, Game Royals. I don't know, man. I guess they just calling them Game Royals because that's what it say on the box. But I was calling them Hyper Royals. I ain't going to lie. But uh, as you see, I'm going to put one down for y'all. But give me y'all a good look real quick. Bam. So let's get in. We don't just use this left shoe. So I'm going to tuck the laces back in. And we're going to start at the bottom, y'all. So at the bottom, you see you got that blue bottom on the bottom of the shoe and you can catch it as it goes around the sole right there like most Jordans ones that have normally you can see the color on the sole right there going around it then you got your on your upper going around you got your white black you got your uh blue of course the game royal and you got your black check and got an extra set of laces which are blue and you got the black laces that come in them I'm probably gonna keep it funky and just rock it with the black laces y'all and I'm gonna go ahead and pull this out for y'all so y'all can check this out. So everybody talk about quality. I don't know why they always compare it like shattered backboard and stuff like that. Uh, no shoe, you know, each shoe is different. Each retro one is different. So that doesn't necessarily mean that you gotta always compare it to the shattered backboard. But uh, of course, in today's sneaker society uh, culture, everybody compares Jordan ones to shattered backboards. When, in my opinion, they have not recreated the shattered backboard, it's a totally different leather. Closest to it, I would have to say a lot. Somebody told me that the shoes that released last year, the Black History Months, were pretty good quality. I didn't get those, though. I passed on them. Um, but I would say the Cell Ones, man, that, that, that's probably one of the dopest. And then I really think I really think they did a good job on the Gatorade pack. Very good quality, in my opinion. But jumping into these... Now, if we're going to choose a shoe to say that I'm going to compare to it, I would actually say I would compare this to the Storm Blue. As you see, you do have that nice, when you push it down, it does bounce back. Uh, it's a good quality shoe. Hold on, stand by. Let me, let me, let me grab them. Let me grab those for y'all so y'all can actually see a better comparison with the Storm Blues if you don't own the Storm Blues. All right, y'all? So I'm going to grab them Storm Blues for y'all. Pretty much I'm going to say that I feel like these are pretty much based sort of like the storm blues and if if you look you can see two different colors but pretty much it's the same blue is in the same areas on both shoes just different colors you have the white you have the white wings logo on the storm storm blues and on the game royals you have a black you have a black inside with a black tongue and you also have the uh black going right here in this little patch part, spot right there right there and then you got the black check and you got black laces that came with these and you have the the uh blue laces and with these you have the blue laces and the white laces but quality wise toe box wise and everything i'm gonna say that this is the shoe 
that I would say I feel like this shoe is pretty much the same as. Um, so yeah, that's pretty much that's your game roar. This is releasing this Saturday, and it is only supposed to be seventy five thousand of these, y'all. So we will see. Everybody was talking about bread toes was gonna be mass produced. That it was said that there was only seventy five thousand bread toes. So seventy five thousand is not a lot when you think about it, you all. Seventy five thousand is not a lot. So. 75,000 of these is what they're saying that, they, that they're releasing. So if you're going to get them, don't sleep. I know today in Germany, they had an early release on um, Nike.de and in like France and stuff like that. People were able to get, you got emails, people were able to pick them up today and get them online. But yeah, so this is pretty much it, y'all. Of course, as usual, y'all, I'm going to spend some pictures for y'all so y'all can get a better close up of them. And yeah. I got another pickup for y'all that I wasn't expecting to get today, and I wasn't expecting also to put this on, like, camera for y'all. I was just going to keep it to myself, but why not share it with the Dungeon family, y'all? So, I already had opened up the box, but honestly, I opened it up, and as you can see, I didn't even take it out. I just left it like this. I saw what it was, and now I'm going to get my first looks at the full thing. So this is two t-shirts that I ordered online. And all right, so starting things off, uh, I got a 15% off entire purchase card. And it says like happy holidays on it. I don't, I don't, I don't even, I didn't even get this off of this website to be on the show. Hatandbeyond.com. I, I didn't, I didn't order this off of hatandbeyond.com. Oh, well. So, first things first, just some classic shirts, man. You know, I picked up this, I think this might be too big for your boy. I picked up this Machiavelli Tupac, you know what I'm saying? Man, this joint, this joint is huge, y'all. But I picked this Tupac joint up, you know what I'm saying? Thought that I thought that joint was dope. And to go with that one as well, I had to pick up Tupac and Marilyn Chillin. So those are my two pickups for the shirts. Uh, actually, man, these joints look kind of big. Like, and I'm trying to, once I start back going to the gym, I already know I'm going to cut down a lot. So, uh, yeah, man, these might look a little too baggy on me. Uh, but we'll see how that goes. But like always, y'all, that's pretty much it for the video. I hope you guys enjoy getting a quick look-see at the Game Royals. I will be doing an on-foot video for you all and letting you all see just the on-foot. I'm going to try to mix-match the jeans with them and everything so you guys can see different jeans and just a different style of how you can rock them. Uh, but yeah, I'm going to do a separate video for that for y'all. And then... um. Got a request, you know what I'm saying? So I will be doing a video over one of the underrated releases that came out previously and hit outlets crazy, but had a crazy storyline about the shoe. And that's one thing about shoes that I like, when the shoes tell a story. Like, there's a story behind the shoes. Like, the I'm Back 10s that came out, that story's dope, but I didn't like the shoe, so I didn't, I didn't get them. Uh, you know, and when you think about like China New Year shoes and, you know, you know, bread ones, cement threes, uh, you know, different, just different shoes, the Gatorade pack, what it symbolizes, Gatorade, the deal, you know, it's crazy, man. Like I like shoes that tell stories, but I also like the OG colors that Jordan played in. So I'm going to be doing a video on that. I'm not going to reveal what shoe it is, but it's a shoe that I feel like it's a retro one that was very underrated. And I'm going to try to push that out to you all as well this week. So be on the lookout for that video dropping this week as well as the on foot of these game royals. And also, I got another surprise for y'all. I don't know if I'm going to be able to drop that video this week or it might drop next week. Just depends on um, when I get the shoes in hand. So, appreciate y'all watching the video like always. If this is your first time, subscribe, drop a comment, smash that like button, y'all. And like always, man, let's get to these pictures, y'all.
run that shit, man. Yeah,